Metabolism. Every organism has to keep taking in and breaking down food in order to keep supplying itself with the energy that it needs to survive. All these activities require energy, which we gain from the food we consume. So how do our bodies actually convert what we eat into usable energy? Metabolism. Take a look at all the chemical reactions that take place inside the human body. Doesn't it seem a bit overwhelming? These chemical reactions are a never-ending set of series that are dedicated to doing two of the most important processes that sustain life. One set of chemical reactions which destroys the materials, while the other set reassembles materials into larger molecules. Hence, these complex and complicated set of processes is referred to as metabolism. These two contradictory processes are called catabolism and anabolism. Catabolism involves the breakdown of complex molecules into simpler ones, which releases energy. Anabolism involves the assembling of smaller molecules to a larger one, which requires energy. The materials that your body needs to build, maintain, and repair itself come in six major groups. Water, vitamins, minerals, carbohydrates, lipids, or fats, and protein. But the three major nutrients that everyone talks about are carbohydrates, lipids, and proteins. Till then, stay tuned.